through the wall. These two. Do you hear them? This is what it is like every cage cleaning night. Why are you always so grumpy? It's the same thing we do twice a week. And they get all chattery and all weird with each other. They have to be the weirdest pigs. If I knew Annie could go with the herd, I honestly would put her with the herd and put Annabelle with Angus and Autumn. Because I really don't think these girls have that great of a bond. Like, they get along sometimes, but they really do not... See, they really do not provide each other with comfort when they're nervous. They just get irritated with each other. But I can't even imagine putting Annie with the herd since she's quite aggressive. Okay, I'll stop stalling because they're just crabby. Okay, so the girls have been cleaned out. So they have really pretty flowers and bees and now that they have all their stuff back and distractions and um Annabelle just peed everywhere in our video um now that they have their distractions back they get along much better but they still are just very confrontational sometimes when they have little head-on encounters like for somebody trying to get somebody else out of a bed out of a bed did I say oust? out? I don't even know if I'm speaking English or like when one of them's in heat I've mentioned before they just get ridiculous so this is the second set of sibling pigs that I've had and even if they technically get along both of my sets of siblings have honestly had the most catty relationship. So the other siblings I had were Kelvin and Hobbs. And Kelvin and Hobbs would have moments like these guys where they got along just fine. And seemed comfortable, were close to each other. And then would have moments of chattering and bickering and bossing each other around. And it's just kind of crazy because like I do not see that behavior with any of the other pigs. So the herd, there's six pigs there. You would think some of them might clash with each other at times. Never, ever, ever do I hear any chattering. It's just normal pig behavior. Where these two, sometimes you can hear Annabelle just squealing and screaming because she's mad that her sister's bothering her, but she's not getting hurt. And they're not losing weight, so it's not like they're stressed to the max. But it's just sometimes they are on each other's nerves and they are really loud and vocal and crabby. So just because they are siblings doesn't mean they always have the best bonds is what I am personally finding. And as I said, I only have had two sibling pairs, but both of them have been the exact same. Where it's get along at some points and other points, they're just absolutely in each other's face being annoyed. So I guess like real siblings. It's just too bad, like if these girls were a little bit calmer, I honestly, personally think I would have split them up, just based off of their behaviors. Like if Annie here, so that's Angus's mom, so she doesn't like Angus, but if she was a little calmer pig, I would honestly put her over with the herd. And Annabelle, I would put with Angus and Autumn, because just based off the intro, well, I didn't really get to see much of the intro, but there's a chance maybe without her sister that they would have got along. But anyway, based off their personalities, since they're both high strung and absolutely wacko, I won't be trying them or won't be separating them. But in an ideal world, I honestly don't think I would have ever kept them as a pair if I had other options, I guess I should say. Yeah, I just, like, the thing that gets me, too, is when they're nervous or stressed out, 
they don't comfort each other they get annoyed and angry with each other which is really weird because usually what you see if they get if piggies get nervous they huddle together and kind of sit together and offer comfort to one another by just huddling and being quiet but these two just go right into being nasty with each other they're very odd little pigs but I love them and they're really sweet pigs it's just together sometimes I'm just like oh my goodness girls chill so that's why um, Angus is the way he is because obviously this family of skinny pigs is just crazy they're very they're not very calm so at least now like they're good it's just so weird how every single cage clean is the same thing and there's been a couple times where I actually am rushing as fast as I can to get their cage clean to get their hay put in get them some distractions because I'm worried that they're gonna be fighting each other because they're doing like the face-offs the chattering it's just crazy they're nuts but they're cute I'm just glad nobody ever gets hurt because honestly if I had to split them up I have no idea what I would do So you girls keep getting along and stop being nuts. See like right now you'd think like they're super close and just a sweet little family. <laughs> you just stole that right out of her mouth. Thank you. Let's get a new cage ready. Just gotta clean this side for a second. What do you think about your mom, Angus? Is she crazy? What's the word? What are you two doing? Hey, gorgeous. They're so pretty on them. Everybody thinks so. Look at your little bum hairs. Where are you going? We were looking at you. I mean, this. Hello, Miss Autumn. I'll let you come back out. You coming back out? Yes, you are. Look at how cute their cage is. Got some black liners that really makes the flowers and the bees pop. Got a really big snuggly set type of bed under there. And a nice big cuddle cup over there. The sweetest little drinker. Yes, you are. No good pieces sticking out, is there? Isn't that always so funny? Like that's all fresh hay. Two of the holes are just stuffed full, but we have to go to the top. There's nothing to eat. How terrible. Hey, Mr. Fuzzy Wuzzy. Look at that back here. 
We've got fuzzy shoulders and a fuzzy back. You're so cute. What are you doing? I'll probably pee in in the corner, aren't you? Hi, sweetie. It's okay. It's just a camera. Yeah, you're nervous. It's not like filming the herd where I can get the camera right in there. One of these days, eh, Autumn? She's disappeared. Where did she go? Where's baby Autumn? There she is. She's coming back. And she's gone again. Just like that. If you like watching guinea pig videos, learning how to care for us, seeing product hauls or reviews, or really anything else guinea pig, please subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. Down below I've left two more videos for you to pick from, so keep on watching!